In this video, we're gonna show you how to replace your front bumper marker light in your 2005 to 2010 Chrysler 300. It's located right here in your front bumper. The process for this is the same for the driver's side. On the driver's side, lower engine splash guard right here, we're gonna have three plastic push pins. I'm gonna go ahead and use our trim tool to pop those off. Once those are out, go ahead and repeat for the passenger side. Get okay, pop these buttons out here. On the center right here, across the main beam, there's gonna be two 10 millimeter bolts holding this splash shield to the cross member. Go ahead and loosen and remove those using your 10 millimeter socket. Across the lower front portion of the bumper, there's a series of seven millimeter screws. Okay, loosen and remove these. The little retaining clips on the back side here have come loose, so we need to grab that with a pair of pliers. And go ahead and remove those there. Once you have your hardware out, go ahead and grab that splash shield slide that out and set it aside. Now on the back side of the bumper cover here, you're gonna have access to this wire harness here that goes to the bulb and your marker light. There is a red lock tab right here. I wanna go ahead and pull that red lock tab back. And that is going to unlock it. Now there's a little spring tab or clip right here. You can press this and wiggle that connector off. Once you have that connector off, the next thing you wanna do is go ahead and loosen and remove this not right here, 13 millimeter. On the right side is a little spring clip here. You're gonna push that in, and then at the same time, you're gonna push the light out. So have your hand on the outside, work that out like so. Now, once you have your light out, if you want to go ahead and replace that bulb, you simply want to grab this back section here, twist it counterclockwise, and pull it out. You'll have the bulb right there. You replace the bulb, install this here, and lock it in, turning it clockwise. Once that's done, go ahead and install your marker light with the locking clip facing the back. Push that in. Snap it in like so. Go ahead and reach up inside. We're going to install that nut. And let's go ahead and snug that down. Grab that wire harness, line that up, push it on. You should feel it in here, it lock into place, and then press that red lock tab back in. Once that lock tab is in, go ahead and install your splash shield. Take your front splash shield, slide that up underneath the bumper. Once that's up in place, we're gonna go ahead and install our two rear screws to hold this in place. Now we can go ahead and start to install our front seven millimeter screws across the whole front of the lip. I'm gonna get all these started by hand and then we can go ahead and snug those down.
install your three plastic push pins for the splash shield into your fender liner here. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.